Hello. Just, uh, <clears throat> uh, sitting here on the couch, trying to get a little warm, so I have my hoodie on. And, uh, and just start to see a planet and a moon as the sun is just about completely out of sight. See a little bit of color in the sky. Just a little artificial light in here. I was just going to have a little sit before my salad for dinner. And uh, the, the visual metaphor is always. Or often for me, uh, you know, a stone in a river. And the river flows by ceaselessly uh, every moment. Uh, always flowing by. The stone doesn't move, doesn't change. Of course, that's not entirely true. The stone won't always be there, but uh, the metaphor works because it's what it appears to be. And the stone is just, there I am. That's that. That happened. That has a tendency. That has an urging. That's happening. There goes that. But in the face of all of that, here I am. <coughs> There's that. Here I am. There's that. Here I am. And so my practice in the sitting is uh, every change that comes up, everything that even, even a catalyst is a change. Uh, a catalyst is a change that's affecting another change. So if it's internal, uh, a change that I become aware of, a change that I bring about, a change that I see coming to me, a change that I recognize in the vicinity. I'm going to just say internally, there's that. There is that. That thing is itself. Over there. There. Not here. Rather than getting caught up in the thinking about it, it's just, there's that. And then to return to my stone in the river. <clears throat> here I am. Here, not there. I, not that. Him. So there's that, is there, is that, right? And here I am. So I kind of substituted uh, two of the first three for two of the second three. The to be is the same, am and is. There's that, here I am. Just realize I might be whispering, so I apologize. I'm going to just have a short sit. <clears throat> Welcome to join me.
there's that. Here I am. <clears throat> no, thank you very much.